today's fuels are precious because they're based on limited resources. Yet these fuels drive our business. They keep us moving. They shape our lives. So we need to use them responsibly. The resulting challenges for R&D are demanding. So a combined effort of every stakeholder involved is required. CID is a collaborative research project co-funded by the European Commission. CID aims at developing and testing new low-weight intelligent structures. And this shape-changing morphing wing has the potential of more efficient flight, meaning less fuel consumption, less carbon dioxide emissions, and more cost-affordable flight. So this innovation in SAID opens new horizons in aviation for the benefit of the citizens, for the benefit of the environment, and also for the benefit of the competitiveness of Europe. Like most large-scale European projects, SAID tackles the questions one by one. Investigating the application of smart and morphing materials on the wing trailing edges on the flaps. This will allow us um, to apply further functionalities as load alleviation as well as variable camera. And this will help us for laminarity for the complete wing. A smart morphing leading edge would look something like this. The absence of slots reduces noise and shape adaptation increases aerodynamic efficiency. Use of a very even surface allows the design of a laminar flow wing. Laminar airflow in the boundary layer reduces the aerodynamic drag significantly. Every unevenness or gap would spoil the laminar flow, thus increasing the fuel consumption. Europe's wing specialists involved need to meet from time to time to review the project development and to exchange views and ideas concerning the innovative solutions the project calls for. New structures are being discussed. Materials that are flexible in one direction and stiff in the other. Design suggestions are being presented in model scale. However, models are easily made the models often do not give answer to questions of the aerodynamic and structural behavior in flight. So few solutions survive the model stage. Next generation wings require laminarization for further drag reduction. Therefore, within the European project SAID, we are investigating morphing high lift components. One of them is the smart leading edge device, which enables a laminar flow it increases high lift performance during starting and, in addition, reduces noise during landing. The life-size wing model with a morphing leading edge is being assembled at the EADS Cassidian facility in Manching. This is a one-to-one -one wing section of an Airbus A320 size wing. It's designed for wind tunnel testing at takeoff and landing wind speeds and wing configurations. Consequently, life size actuators are being installed. This is the first project to demonstrate the feasibility of designing and building a gapless, flexible leading edge with conventional materials and actuation systems. The skin of this test system is a smart and especially tailored GRFP skin designed by DLR. This skin is the key to success. It is of high and even surface quality, possesses sufficient bending stiffness to carry aero loads, while at the same time being deformable. The town of Dukovsky is the aeronautical center in the Moscow region and the home of Tsaji, the Central Aerohydrodynamic Institute. This is T-101, Tsaji's very large wind tunnel. It was built in 1937 
and still has some outstanding features. This wind tunnel was chosen for our SAID project because it was possible to design and fabricate big size model due to big size. Horizontal axis of ellipse equal 24 meter and vertical axis 14. Another essentiality of this wind tunnel, high flow velocity equal to maximum 50 meter per second. The test control and data recording take place in a room underneath the model stand. 13 megawatts of power generate real-life conditions for the say droop nose. Every nose and flap configuration is tested under all relevant angles of attack. After each test run, the model is taken down for inspection and to change the test configuration. After the first test run, the engineers and scientists could hardly wait until the model was ready for inspection. It's a fantastic uh, result for now and uh, yeah, we hope to see the next runs and uh, hopefully we, we can proceed so successfully. SAID has taken the adaptive wing technology quite a step further towards more efficient and quieter wings thanks to collaborative research.